Okay, this is going to show you how to create a lead generating button for your Facebook business page story. First of all, go to your Facebook business page. Then click the plus button. Now it's going to give you some options. Add to story, view to story, view profile or choose new. You're going to add to story. Then it's going to give you some options inside of your camera roll. Now you can either choose your camera roll or you can use the text option, the boomerang option, the mood option or selfie option or the poll option. Personally, as a digital marketing strategist, I would suggest that you do your story from scratch. So in other words, you use either a picture from your camera roll or you use your camera. Now, if you do use the picture from the camera roll, you can select multiple pictures and therefore you will have multiple stories going up at any one time. Let's just show you how to create one. So you click on the camera and it's instantly going to go to your forward facing, which is why it's black on my camera. If I wanted to take a picture of what's happening at the moment, I'd turn it on reverse. And as you can see, I'm actually recording this outside. So what I'm gonna do now is if I want to do a boomerang, which is a quick video, I can actually press that and do like so, and it will show you what I'm doing. Now, what I wanna show you first of all, is I want to go back and just take a normal photograph. So if you take a normal photograph, all you need to do is take a picture, and then this is where the magic happens, because on your Facebook business page, there is an option that is hidden behind this drop-down box. Now, when you click see more, it actually gives you some more options. And these are super, super important as a lead generation option inside of your Facebook business page stories. As you can see, we have stickers, text, tag people, effects, draw, animate, and buttons. Now, buttons are what I want to concentrate on today. If you click buttons, it's going to give you some options inside of your page. Now, here you can see that we have view shop, view product, view book now, call now, get directions, learn more. The ones that are unshaded are not active on your page at the moment. As soon as you add one of these features to your page, in other words, once you add an event, this will become active. If you add a job application, that will become active. If you have an offer on offer, that will become active. But what I wanna to talk to you about is this custom link at the top here. So as you can see, it says custom link. Now this custom link allows me to add a unique link to my story. So if I come out here and go into my Google and I type in my website address, and then I go to my sign up page. So I want to go to my offer page. So to join the digital lab, then I'm going to copy this link by double tapping and copying. And then I'm going to go back into my story. Now the story allows me to add this link in. And as you can see, it lets you visit it if you want to. I'm going to just add it in. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to just share this for the purpose of this video. So go ahead and share the story. And as you can see, the circle around my profile picture is whirring. That means that the story is uploading as we speak. Now, also another thing to notice is that I'm acting as my page. You see here, I can act as my page and I can act as me. If you're not seeing the link option, it may be that you're not acting as your page. So go ahead and act as your page to make sure you see that link option. Now, in order for you to see your button on your story, you do need to go into somebody else's account. So if you're not seeing the button when you've done what I've just showed you, don't worry. You just need to ask a friend to check out your link. So I've just logged into my partner's account and I just want to show you. So basically, here's my story and I'm not in my account. I'm in my husband's account. So when I click on it, I want to go back. So these are the ones that I did without the link so as you can see at the bottom it says send me a message then we go through to the next one and it's got um, what happened yesterday so this is the one I've just showed you so basically what happens I'll just stop it for a second you can see at the bottom so now what happens is I have a see more button I have a share and I have all the emojis so when I click see more it's actually going to open up onto the page that I shared so that's the unique link that I've just added into my 
Facebook business page stories without spending any money, without paying for ads, and without paying anyone else to do it. So that's what you can do with your own story. So just to show you again, this is the next one that I did. As you can see, I click see more, and it takes me directly to that sign up page, which is on my own website. So this is outside of Facebook. As you can see, if I click the three dots, you can see that I can open it in the browser. It's allowed me to do a lead generating story for my Facebook business page stories without spending any money and without spending any ad spent. So I hope you found that super useful short little video on how to add a lead generating link to your Facebook business page stories without spending a penny on ad spend. So this has been available inside of Facebook for quite some time, but it goes overlooked because it's hidden underneath that menu bar. So go and explore those super essential buttons for generating leads from your Facebook business page stories. Don't forget that if you've enjoyed this video, give me the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to learn more secret hacks about how to use your Facebook business page as a marketing tool to generate leads across your social networks. Thanks very much, see you soon.